Will your home pass the test? Can you sell your home for top dollar right now? Or do you need to do a few things to make sure that you get top dollar? Hi, I'm Ronnie Jordan. And I'm Doug Arnett. We're owners of OKC Metro Group. Let's take the quiz to see if your home passes the sell for top dollar test. We've sold hundreds of homes, so we know what we're talking about. Here we go. When you walk up to your home, does it have curb appeal? Nothing sets the stage better than curb appeal. As you approach your home, try to see it through a buyer's eyes. Fresh landscaping, vibrant plants, clean trim, and a welcoming door paint can substantially enhance perception. In some cases, a fresh coat of paint can work wonders. Now, have you done the three Ds? Decluttered, depersonalized, and deep clean. And I mean clean, really clean. Baseboards, scuff marks, cleaned up the landscape, changed out old light bulbs and more. Is your lawn lavish and green or a little yellow and crispy? Yes, these things really matter. Are the walls painted a neutral color? Have you patched holes? Painted the front door and trim? Hey, brick red walls with mismatched paint does not quantify selling at top dollar, at least not in this market. Do you have neutral carpets that are clean? Are they 10 years old that have been cleaned about 15 times? And once it rains and people walk all over it a few times, well, the truth really comes out. This isn't going to cut it to get top dollar. Do you have updated flooring and countertops? Are your cabinets still the same as they were 15 years ago? Or have you updated them? Does your lot compare to the one half acre lot that is up the street? You see, all of this matters. And this is the big one, the smell test, OMG. I'm sure you don't realize this, but did you know that most people have a smell to their home? Yes, a smell. I know it sounds gross, but it's true. Every home carries its unique smell, which surprisingly plays a role in the buying process. And as adorable as pets are, their presence can often perfume a house in a less favorable way. What about cooking? Do you cook with spices that you're used to, but if someone else came over, it would smell like a fish fry? Again, it's a no-go. Now, have you truly compared your home to your competition? I mean, everyone, including me, thinks that I have the best home on the block. It's natural to love your home. And much like parents' fondness for their children, we often view ours as the best. However, stepping back from that bias and comparing it to the competition on the market can provide invaluable insights. And is your home partially staged or fully staged with modern furniture to ensure it shows to the best of its ability? The right staging has the power to transform a house into a potential buyer's dream home. Does your interior resonate with modern trends or does it have nostalgic touch, more likely to be found at grandma's house? Staging your home in a contemporary style can significantly uplift its appeal. Now, the view, or the lack thereof, adds to your home viewer's experience. Does the outlook present a serene landscape or accidentally provides a glimpse into the neighbor's shower routine? Now, the latter usually is less compelling for the home buyers. So go ahead, take the sell for top dollar test, rate your home from one to 10, and identify if you're ready to put your home on the market for its deserving value. Now, most of us have to make a few changes and that's completely okay. Just remember, the process is meant to lead you straight to a successful and rewarding sale.